When it comes to uh, consumption, you know, yeah. I think that um, there's a lot of diets out there. There's a, there's a lot of different things, and some of them work for some people and some work for others, right? There's no one-size-fits-all solution. I think uh, in my practice, what I use way more than telling people what to eat is telling people how to eat. Because when we change how we eat, then we end up st we, we start will um, making different choices about what we're putting in our body. So this is really simple. Anyone can do this. You know, three or four basic rules. One is when you sit down with your food, take a deep inhalation, like smell your food, let it get into you, and then do that three times. Okay. Three breaths before your first bite of food will feel like an eternity. <laughs> you know, it's amazing how people, uh, you know, actually struggle to just sit there and smell their food and take three breaths. But what's happening is you're shifting out of fight or flight uh, nervous system into the rest and digest nervous system. You're allowing your gut to turn on and get ready to uh, receive the food. And you're allowing your mind to get into a state where it can really appreciate that food. Okay, the more we appreciate the food, the less we're going to eat. Because I know that sounds totally paradoxical, but, but step number two is to chew your food thoroughly and focus on the savoring, focus on the appreciation of it. So, so this is a mindfulness practice while eating. Don't get distracted and watch the TV. Little conversation's okay, but let, let the conversation you know, kind of happen when you're waiting for the food to be ready and while you're finishing those last bites and sitting around afterwards. The, the main part of the meal should be devoted to chewing thoroughly so you can get all the nutrients inside your food you don't need to eat more and to savoring that experience and basically you're using the circuitry in your brain of appreciation then two or three times a day and and you're just going to get better and better at appreciating other things in your life and you're going to stop when you're full because you're going slowly and and you're uh, savoring and appreciating the food so i mean those those couple things are just so um, paramount to healthy eating Hi, John Malaki here with the United Patients Group. I hope you've enjoyed our videos. Please click like as well as subscribe to our channel here on YouTube. Also, follow us on Twitter at U Patients Group and on Facebook at United Patients Group, as well as for our podcasts. Please click the link in the description below. We'll see you there. Bye-bye.